Top 10 Things to Do in Zadar, Croatia Zadar might not be overflowing with the same kind of open-air museum feel as some other Adriatic towns, but that doesn't mean it isn't an intriguing and charming place to spend some time. The old town is full of wonderful tourist attractions for you to explore while its rejuvenated waterfront is the perfect place to kick back and relax. Its innovative art installations really make it a unique hangout spot. Fun, friendly and full of life, there is always something on a list of things to do in Zadar for everyone to enjoy. 10. Saint Simeon's Church Painted half in bright orange, half in dazzling white, Saint Simeon's Church is pretty enough to look at without setting the world alight. Visitors invariably stop by to see its fantastic interior. Hanging above the main altar, the wooden sarcophagus of Saint Simeon is absolutely spellbinding due to its intricate designs, decorations, and inscriptions in silver and gold. Unbelievably detailed, it is this spectacular sarcophagus that makes Saint Simeon so special to visit. 9. Museum of Ancient Glass Home to a fantastic collection that explores a huge range of Roman glassware, the Museum of Ancient Glass is an interesting and educational place to visit with a lot to offer. Located in the stunning Cosmosendi Palace that dates back to 1877, the museum has some awe-inspiring views over Jezine Harbor. With goblets, cups, vials and more, the displays are delightful to peruse and you can even watch glass-blowing demonstrations. Watching the creation of glassware is a mesmerizing experience and the myriad of objects on display are captivating in their elegance and design. 8. Landgate A beautiful monument, the Landgate was built in 1573 and heavily resembles a Roman triumphal arch. The Lion of Saint Mark is still perched atop it. The impressive Landgate actually commemorates the Holy League's naval victory over their eastern neighbors. Its Renaissance architecture looks splendid and much of the city is still protected by the limestone walls that surround Zadar. 7. Church of Saint Donatus Dating back to the 9th century, the Church of Saint Donatus is one of the best-preserved pre-Romanesque churches in the world and is well worth stopping by when you're in Zadar. One of the most important landmarks in the city, the church is simple yet beautiful and its rounded walls give it a distinctive look. Located on the Roman Forum, the Church of St. Donatus was built using some of the rubble and building material from the ruins of the Forum. As such, it perfectly complements the look and feel of its ancient surroundings. 6. Roman Forum Built between the 1st century BC and the 3rd century AD, Zadar's Roman Forum is the largest east in Croatia and is situated at the heart of the historic center. With some lovely ancient foundations and columns for you to explore, visiting the Roman Forum is an interesting experience. 5. Archaeological Museums First opened back in 1832, the Archaeological Museum hosts a fantastic collection of ancient artifacts, there are over 100,000 items for you to peruse to your heart's content. Exhibiting everything from weapons and mosaics to ceramics and household items, the museum's extensive collection is well worth checking out. Among the most interesting items on display are the artifacts that were found in the graves of ancient nobles that date back to the Middle Ages. 4. Narodny TRG Known in English as People's Square, Narodny TRG has long been at the center of public life in Zadar. The beautiful square certainly is magnificent to behold, with its fine old buildings and dazzling white flagstones. Drenched in history, the square is home to the impressive clock tower of the City Guard Building and the lovely 11th century Church of St. Lawrence, among others. With art, history, and culture all on offer, Narodny TRG has something for everyone to enjoy. 3. St. Anastasia's Cathedral Located on the site of an ancient Christian basilica that dates all the way back to the 4th century, St. Anastasia's Cathedral is absolutely gorgeous, with a lovely Romanesque facade and looming bell tower. When visiting the cathedral, a climb to the top of its huge bell tower is a must, it offers up a stunning view of Zadar. 2. Greeting to the Sun Looking out over the Adriatic, Zadar's waterfront is a marvelous place to watch the sun go down. Nikola Basic's inspired, greeting to the sun, installation only adds to the perfect scene. Circular in design, the installation absorbs the sun's energy during the day and then creates a magical series of whirling patterns and colors as night falls, lighting up the waterfront with its creative and dazzling displays. 1. Sea Organ Jutting out into the sea and located right at the tip of the peninsula on which Zadar's old town is based, the Sea Organ is an amazing art installation that will captivate and enchant visitors. Its 35 organ pipes emit soothing sounds, 
sitting on the marble steps that border the water is a heavenly experience as the sun dips into the sea at the end of the day. Ingenious in design, the sea organ helped breathe new life into the city's waterfront and is now a very popular hangout spot with tourists and locals alike.